and welcome back to Little Book's Great Stories. Today to celebrate thankfulness, we're going to be reading Llama Llama Thanks for Giving Day. In this story, Llama Llama goes around his town with his friends to help out people like teachers and firefighters who do so much for the community. Show that you're thankful and subscribe to Little Book's Great Stories and like this video. Llama Llama Thanks for Giving Day Llama Llama and his friends are learning about safety. The town's safety officer, Officer Flamingo, shows them how to stop, look, and listen. All of a sudden, he slips and falls right on his ankle. Ouch! Looks like you've sprained your ankle, Dr. Hackney says. You'll be on crutches for a couple of days, Officer Flamingo. It's okay, everyone, the officer replies. A hurt ankle won't stop me from doing my job. But the next day, Officer Flamingo tries to direct traffic, and he realizes that crutches make doing the job difficult. Mama, Grandma, and Llama see that Officer Flamingo needs help. They take over directing traffic so he can go home and rest. Back at the house that afternoon, Llama and his friends think about all the things that Officer Flamingo does in the neighborhood to keep them safe. If you think about it, there are a lot of grown-ups who help all around town, Luna realizes. Maybe we can make a special day to help all these helpers who help us, suggests Llama. It could be like Thanksgiving, adds Euclid. You mean like a thanks for giving day, asks Llama. Everyone loves the idea. The next day, Llama and his friends begin their Thanks for Giving Day plans at school. They volunteer to help with a fun science project to thank their teacher, Zelda Zebra. Mama and Grandpa Llama help the class make a cool volcano that actually erupts. Next, Llama and his friends go to the library. They thank the librarian, Lenora Leopard, by helping organize books. Wow, says Llama. It sure takes a lot of work to run a library. Lenora appreciates the extra help. Then Llama and his friends go over to Nellie's house to learn about firefighting. Mama Nu, a volunteer firefighter, teaches them how to coil a fire hose into a neat circle. Suddenly, Mama Nu gets an emergency call. Gilroy's sister is stuck in a tree. She climbed too high trying to get a ball that was caught in its branches. Mama Nu rushes to the rescue with Llama and his friends right behind her. Mama Nu gives everyone instructions on how to help. Llama and his friends hold a large safety net under the tree. Jump, Sister Goat! yells Mama Nu. With a giant leap, Sister Goat jumps into the net. Safe and sound, says Mama Nu. She gives the ball back to Sister Goat with a smile. After the excitement of the rescue, Llama and his friends pay a visit to Eleanor Elephant. She's picking up litter in the park. We want to say thanks for doing this, and to thank you, can we also help you? asks Luna. Llama and his friends grab extra trash bags and get to work helping the cleanup effort. Thanks for the thanks, and thanks for helping. Eleanor Elephant says. Llama and his friends have thanked so many people, but the day isn't over yet. They head to Daddy New's bakery to thank him for feeding everyone in the community, especially those who need it most. Daddy New offers them a sweet treat, which gives Nellie an idea. What if we gave special treats to all the community helpers? She asks. Llama Llama and his friends decide to host a special celebration to honor all the community helpers the very next day. It is soon time for the big celebration. All the community helpers gather at the park gazebo, which Llama and his friends have decorated with colorful balloons and banners. Welcome to our first annual Thanks for Giving Dinner! exclaims Llama. Wow! says Mama Nu. This is amazing! Let's celebrate, exclaims Mama Llama, kicking off the fun. Llama and his friends have planned lots of exciting games and activities. 
They have a ball toss and a potato sack race, and they even do a silly dance inspired by Officer Flamingo. Finally, Llama and his friends present the helpers with a special cake and a poem. We appreciate all the things you do, and most of all, we appreciate you. They recite together. Thank you. Thank you, kids. Says Officer Flamingo. The thanks for giving celebration is a great success. Everyone celebrates by doing the flamingo dance together. Thank you so much for listening to today's read aloud. I hope you come back again next week for more and more great stories that I'm going to be reading here on Little Books Great Stories. <laughs>